What's up, y'all? Advance here, reporting to you live from the front lines in Baltimore. And this is Advanced Sports Talk. <laughs> All right, so not a good night for the Buccaneers, obviously. Everything that could have went wrong went wrong. And yeah, what what can be said about it? Um, I was very critical of McMillan. You should not call yourself open if you're not open, <laughs> if you're indeed covered. But I gotta give him, I gotta give him some grace because he's a rookie. But uh, positives, we started strong. That's good. Um. So so ending, we was moving the ball, but aside from the fact that we lost the the, the linchpin of our offense, Chris Godwin, uh, uh, our leading scorer Mike Evans, we lost him in in the beginning in the first half. Uh, aggravated that hamstring injury. I was wondering if he maybe should have sat out this game. If it would have been better for him to sit out this game. But nonetheless, um, <clears throat> here we are. So we, so we are down our two best receivers. We at least have Mike Evans is going to be gone for at least four games. He's got to be. And even if, even if it's sooner, I would still say sit out the four games because it's better to have him, like have him finish strong during the stretch, during the second half of the season than to risk aggravating that um, that injury. We got 700 yards that we got to get him. Uh, well, minus whatever whatever he did today. We got to uh, we got to check that out. I'll do the, do a final tally. But we, he's got 700 yards to go before before we can break Jerry Rice's record. Uh, what else? Run game was good. Rashad White and Bucky Irvin and Sean Tucker. <laughs> yeah, so <clears throat> we got a nice, uh, we got a pretty, uh, we got a pretty decent three-headed dragon <laughs> back there, you know, back in that backfield. So uh, <clears throat> we got a, I don't know what's going on with the Buccaneers in the second quarter, but we got a, we got to shape that up. We got to, um, yeah. <laughs> we we can't we can't we got to stop having bad second quarters. Now, aside from the money that I lost on um, you know that I put up for today's game or for tonight's game, and the fact that you know I basically got embarrassed in front of my hometown, what I always say: if you must lose lose out of conference so once again this is a, a loss that's it, it's gonna sting I would say it's a loss that doesn't really hurt us record wise playoff playoff contention wise it's not gonna hurt us cause you know it's, it's an out of conference loss but this loss does hurt because of what we lost during the game. So we got, um, you know, like I said, Godwin is probably going to be out for the season. His injury, they didn't even want to. They didn't even want to show the replay. That's how bad it was. Um, Evans aggravated his hamstring, so he's going to be. He's got to go on injured reserve. It'd be a miracle if he doesn't. I, I would still, I'd still sit him because. I don't know if that's the same hamstring that he's been dealing with the last couple of seasons, but yeah, yeah, he's got to get some, uh, I don't know, get some, some gene therapy or whatever, but yeah, so we're down our two best receivers. Luckily, we, we've done pretty okay with depth. Um, all right, Trey Palmer. I'm not. I'm not concerned about Trey Palmer. Sterling Shepard is enough of a veteran to where he can fill in the gaps 
Uh, he can fill in the gaps where um, until we get back. Uh, we've rediscovered Kate Otten, <laughs> so so we should we should be able to uh, we should be able to plug the holes in the ship until you know until Mike Evans comes back. Now, uh, <laughs> like I said, run game run game is straight. Defense, um, that second Rashad Bateman touchdown, that was all Antoine Winfield Jr. Because he tried to show blitz, and it left that part of the field wide open. There was no help over the top. Special teams did a good job, especially with that, that onside kick recovery. Um don't know if we would have been able to win the game with it, but we definitely definitely gave us a chance to cover the spread. But we didn't do that either. So <laughs> but in any case, those are my thoughts on Buccaneers. Buccaneers versus Ravens Monday night game. Uh let me know how your how, let me know how your team did this weekend. Put your comments in the comment section down below. Let's chop chop it up. Start this conversation. Can't even get my words right. Chop, we gonna chop it up and start this conversation. My name's Advance. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe on everything. I'm out. <laughs>